Okay, Ray has found what I think is going to be the perfect focal point at the end of the two beds. And I'm not hating this beautiful maple up there. Gorgeous! Good job, Ray. <laughs> I'm like a hound dog. If you get a task and I just focus on it, get <laughs> it done. You do. You definitely do. <laughs> you got it done. I thought for sure I was leaving without the focal point. It's gorgeous. I was a little worried it's too big, but we'll see. Here it is out in the light. We're trying to figure out which ones are in the best shape. Looks wise. This one has a lot of um, yeah. of the yeah. coating off of it. I think we should find out what um, what they're made of. Yeah. Look at this place. Isn't it a dream? Everywhere you look. Gorgeous. So much I want to buy. <laughs> I mean, have you ever ho heard of holy basil? <laughs> Ray is checking to see if that basil has been blessed by the Pope. What makes this basil holy, Ray? Has it told you? No. Okay, if anybody knows, please report back on what makes this basil holy because now we need to know. There's the tag. It looks like it's blooming. It, it does. It looks like it went to seed. It went, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's it. Holy smokes, <laughs> this, holy. this thing bolted. <laughs> More I think I just want the healthiest looking one. Get this standing up better. Okay. There we go. There you go. You just pick the right, the right one. Ooh! Look at all the pretty flowers. We're so lucky to live 20 minutes from this place. Aren't they beautiful? Every color you can think of, oh, this is us right here. Yeah. Oh, when that coming out of our, our new birdcage, wait until you see our new birdcage. Mother's Day present. Founded at a nonprofit antique shop that benefits um, someone with medical needs. I think that's very pretty. Yeah. Try to decide. This would maybe some ferny things. Too spindly. Yeah. What about those curly? Uh, this looks like a hosta. It does. Yeah. I think I like the Boston fern look, but I don't know that it'll take over in New Guinea, right? Right. I don't know. They're nice do... looking. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they'd be pretty. I don't think New Guineas need deadheading. We need things that don't need deadheading yeah. because. Our boxes are very high, but I'm I still thinking that fuchsias hanging over the edge would look gorgeous, right? Fuchsias, yeah. yeah. Maybe like one big fuchsia in the middle hanging right. over. Right, right. Some potato vine. And potato vine on the edges. Yeah. There you go. Potato vine starts to make our house look like a haunted house, but <laughs> it's kind of cool too. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it grows slow in those boxes. 
All right, well, we'll keep thinking on it and yep. keep looking around. <laughs> so many ideas. Do you like these, though? Okay, so final decision made. <laughs> Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. Potato vine and the Borealia. Borealia. I'm sorry, I cannot pronounce this word. Um, I've grown this before, it's wonderful. In our front window boxes. We're gonna keep them simple this year um, with no deadheading needed because getting up on that ladder is tough. Hmm. Good work, Ray. You pleased? Yeah, it's gonna be good. <laughs> <laughs> Look at how gorgeous these are. I love delicate flowers. They're beautiful. They are beautiful. The one I had planted in there before had more pink on it, but I think that this is just young, maybe. They take a long time to bolt also and bloom. So they don't require all that pinching. He's gonna test the weight of the urn to make sure we're gonna be able to lift it because they are cement. So much gorgeous stuff goals I want that in my kitchen garden really bad <laughs> okay so we bought a bird cage so we need to find a proper size cocoa liner to mm. go in it and um, then we got to decide mm. what we're gonna put in the I think that's it right uh, so sure. yeah this weekend a lot of stuff won't be here because somebody's going to buy this for mom. Is that what you're saying? Somebody's mother. Somebody's mother's going to be very happy. <laughs> Some mother's going to be happy. <laughs> <laughs> At McDonald's, right? Yeah. They were, um, as I pulled up, it shouldn't have been in there, but I was getting French fries. And when I pulled up, uh, they were, they, he was talking about, and she was telling them to buy edible fruit. And I said, no, give mom a thousand dollars. And he looks at me and goes, yeah, because that's what every mother wants. I said, yes. I said, that's what I'm asking for, $1,000. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, what would you say that weighs? These are heavy duty. These are 15 pounds. 15 pounds. They are heavy. When you pick them up, you don't think 15 pounds is heavy until you pick that thing up. So they are well made. Yeah. Of course, we need a forklift for loading this stuff. I wish we could take that forklift home. <laughs> there goes one. I will help him. I always do. <laughs> Feeling like Superman up there?
super exciting. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about them bumping. I got one more for you. Okay, cool. Fresco soft shell tacos. Okay. And I need uh, two black bean fresco hard shell tacos. Okay. And uh, two iced teas, please. I'm sorry, you said it again? Two iced teas. Okay, um, sweet and sweet. Sweet, non sweet. Sweet. Sweet, please. Sweet. Okay, what size? Small, medium, or large? Medium. Okay, medium. Okay. Anything else? That's it. Alright, do you want any sauce in the bag? Uh, yes, mild, please. Mild. Okay. Alright, it comes up to thirteen sixty-three. Come to the first window. Thank you. Okay, so we just dropped way too much money at the garden center, but we did find uh, two cement urns at the price we want to pay for them. So of course now we're going to Taco Bell because it's after six and we're hungry and Ray has a lot of heavy lifting to do when we get home because we have no idea yeah. how we're going to get these they're urns. Heavy. They're probably out of anything we've ever bought. It's probably the heaviest. Except for the back fountain, right? <gasps> yeah. Yeah. Okay, top, I was gonna the top, say they're heavier the, the, than the well, back the, the bowl base, of the fountain. The base of the back fountain that we put in last year was yeah, that was uh and it was they're probably comparable to the middle middle bowl. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, they're heavy. They're yeah. Heavy. They're so heavy. we have no idea. But every single time we have no idea, we get it done. So it may be comical, but they are really beautiful and we just got to drive slow and hope to get them home without them chipping. So that's the idea. And so we'll see you after tacos. <laughs> oh boy, what were we thinking, Ray? We were, uh... Not... Oh, it's gonna be good, it's gonna be good. Yeah. They're heavy. They're very, very heavy. I already have a wounded foot. Yeah, but as well, I had to I got, show him I today, a, I, I didn't a, say anything, but I, I hurt my foot pretty bad the other day. I got a couple of ideas where so. we're going to use, uh, use leverage and make it work. <laughs> Love them. And then we found this old rusted birdcage. Ray got it for me for Mother's Day. We're gonna take off the silk flowers that someone put on there, or plastic flowers. They're probably not silk anymore, but pretty cool. Need some steel wool. Probably won't get to that this year, and its bottom is rusted, but we love it. It was more economical to buy the hanging baskets, which we're gonna divide and split to make up the window boxes on the front of the house. Okay, so what's the plan? Birdhouse first? Yeah. All right. You just throw that down to me. Oh, you're gonna get it over there? Oh, okay. I'll take it back. Oh! Yeah, why do you make this look easy? <laughs> it's so heavy. Okay, so what is your plan? We're All just right, going to so lift this down? These we're just going to lift right down okay. and put on the, uh, on the cart.
No fingers. Okay. I got it. All right. There we go. Okay. So where do you think you want it set? Well, I'm thinking right here there. because we're going to want enough prep okay. to get around it and yep. we need to be able to get the barrel through there. Exactly. Okay. Okay. So yep. I'm thinking, is this okay? Yeah. I'm thinking this kind of seems center. Okay. Yep. Okay. Yep. All you gotta do now is just get it close to the edge and then move from there. Should I get up there and help? Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Bam. Okay. So did they have a weight on this? <laughs> How many hundreds of pounds do you think it is? Oh, uh, it's at least, this piece is probably about 225 to 250. Oh, goodness. So, yeah, it's heavy. Now, I'm gonna get on this side. You come over this side, all right? And when I lift this up, put, it put under. that under. Gonna not really be near it. And what we need to do is what we didn't do the last time mm -hmm. is we need to weight down this end. The cart, right? Like maybe that board. No, you're gonna you're gonna sit on it. No, I'm gonna help you with this. No, we need at least a hundred pounds. Really? Up front there. Yeah. Well, how are you gonna do this all on your own? It should just be leverage. All right, now we're gonna switch sides, okay? okay. Should be good. Should be good. You shimmy it? I'm not. We're gonna actually stand it up right if we can. Oh, okay. So we're gonna flip it. Yep. There we go. Watch your feet now. Okay. You get off the car. I can? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Get off. Get off. Okay. Now. Work out nicely. Here. Let's the two of us stand it up. Right. And shimmy it. There we go. Nice. Okay, now will it be able to with it? Where should we get these? Yeah. Oh, shoot, there it goes. Okay, yeah, that'll work. Okay, and then we got, probably. We need a, do you have a second one? Let's see if what that'll stabilize it more. Okay, that's better. Right, it's still rocking, side. though. Yeah, it's Hang rocking on. pretty good, right? Hang on. How about we use these on the side and that at the front? That's that's much. It's bigger. much higher. Yeah. Oh, okay. Here we go. Here's another piece. You might want to. Okay. Short one. Yeah. And then what we'll do is. There we go. Oh, okay. It's there. Okay. Four by four, right here. Okay. I got it. I got it. Okay. He's 
There's no way you can lift this yourself. No. No. Keep it up on that side though. Because that's giving me, that's going to help me. Oh, now you blocked the camera though. Uh, I had no choice. <laughs> that's okay. One, two, three. Uh, oh. Okay. All right. Pull the line. Okay. This, this crimp. It's on it. Yeah. It's on it. There we go. There we go. Got it. Okay. There we go. <laughs> oh, hello, fiction. Well. All right. Ready for number two? Well, are you ready for number two? Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we gotta clear this space. We're gonna put urn number two. That's going over on the patio, right? Yep. Okay. This one's gonna be a bit a bit trickier. For one, yeah. we won't be able to level it. Uh yeah. And for two. Well, maybe we'll get lucky in this. Okay, so this is what's happening to our garden trees they become top heavy and then our winds here every day we come home and there's a new shattered pot so that's why these heavy cement urns are being everything's being replaced with them because yeah our winds are just too bad here <laughs> over there. What, that? Everything is low. Okay, hold up. Let me get my muscles ready. Okay. Okay. I feel pumped. Okay, here we go. Uh, uh. Okay, right there. We're good. <laughs> I was worried to be too low. Now I'm, man, this thing is massive. Okay. Urn in and it's massive. It's dwarfing the couch. <laughs> oh, put that back in there. Oh, sure. And so what we were doing was was fishing through the two, the base and and um, the pottery, the uh, quarter inch line for irrigation. Um, so because we forgot the the first time we lifted and we had to lift that twice. It's a bear. It's yeah. a bear. It's hundreds of pounds. Yeah. So it's it's heavy. I'm I'm absolutely shocked that we lifted this and didn't have to call another man. Yeah. <laughs> we don't need nobody. <laughs> Been doing this for twenty some years. Yeah, I know. Maybe in another twenty. We yeah. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Hopefully. Maybe. Hopefully, Hopefully, Hopefully we not. will not be doing this anymore. Hopefully not. No, and sorry. we will have a mini forklift back here. <laughs> no, no, nothing's going to be able to get back here. Nothing. <laughs> We're going to be, uh, this is going to be an island. <laughs> Nothing, nothing's going to make it. <laughs> hey, they do it on that island. What is the name of the island that, um. Oh, up in the northeast? Yeah, the yeah. Uh, oh, gosh. Um, yeah. It's always on, uh. Laura, it was Garden, Garden Answer. Answer did, uh. Yeah, it's up in. 
like near the Great Lakes or something or yeah what is the name of the island I, I don't remember it's not Montauk is it oh uh, might be Montauk Island is uh, it it sounds familiar okay well we don't know <laughs> Sounds familiar. But anybody who watches Garden Answer knows the island where they they have to use horse and carriage and bicycles. So they get their stuff around. So we're kind of like that island now. You can't, we're so enclosed with the rooms now that everything has to be carried in. Yeah. When the boulder got halfway down the uh, it's makeshift on, ramp, do we have that on video? We, I, I I'm not know. sure if we have the, but we do have the boulder and the aftermath of the anyway, boulder the, sitting in the driveway. Yeah, it snapped the two by ten yeah. in half. Almost broke my, my wrist. Oh, oh, yeah, Nicole almost got hurt really bad. It flipped the cart over. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it was lucky that nobody got hurt. And uh, then the the probably 350 pound boulder. Uh, laid in the driveway. Don't for do a that. While. You're gonna get dirt in your I eye. Did. Look what you I just did. did. Stop. Ah. Ah. Yeah. So we do this stuff, and we've been doing this stuff together. Um, what? We've been together 35 years. So we've been doing this for 35 years. We are very experienced doing this kind of stuff, and for the most part, we're good at jumping out of the way. For the most part, but yeah. you do get hurt doing this stuff. So we don't recommend anybody else trying what we're doing. Don't try this at home. Don't try this at home. <laughs> so, yeah, so that's basically but what today, we're saying. today, based upon that method, uh, today we used four by four posts as the ramp and they were not going to snap. Yeah. So. Okay, we're signing off now and we're going in because... We're tired. We're tired. <laughs> We're so tired. <laughs> <laughs> Fix your hand. What are you doing? What's going on?